Hello, people of the YouTubes! My man here, and it's time for another episode of Dungeon Siege 3. So, we are going to do the Battle for Raven's Rill, open the causeway. That is the only quest we have, and it is this way. So, it's been a few days since I played this game, um, but that shouldn't be much of a problem. Uh, you know, not, not a very hard game to get back into. Shouldn't be too hard. I know A is attack. And, and L is, is roll and block. L is block. Not that I ever block, but uh, I think this is, yeah, this is the causeway. Alrighty. I have entered it. Oh, oh no, I guess I had Oh wow, now I have. That is really bright. Uh, whoa, this looks crazy. Alright. What world was this, I wonder? And how did the Legion find their way here? That is a good question, Anjali. Alrighty, so this is crazy looking. Um, there's a save point here. Let me see if I can actually get to it. Yep, alright, there we go. This way, alright. So, uh, battle for Raven's Rill, huh? I guess we're about to save the town. Uh, looks like this is the only way I can go for now. Um, it was telling me to go this way, and looks like this is just a singular path. I don't think it splits off. No, looking at the map, it does not split off at all. So, into here we go, and if you heard that sound in the background, that was uh, me getting an email. This Sorry mausoleum about that. belonged to the Gundrex, an old and unlucky family. Really? Did they leave me any loot? Oh, they did. Be ready. They had left me some loot. Alright. Uh, Anjali is apparently going to go protect me. Uh, her and her little bird guy. Her bird guy. I mean, dog. Fiery dog thingy. Uh, and apparently I don't have enough focus to do anything right now. So that's not that's not too much of a problem. Um, Anjali is doing a pretty good job on her own. Uh, get some more loot here. And yes, I'm probably going to check every little area that I can for loot. And apparently I really can't hit these guys. Um, ranged is, is probably the best way of doing so, and I am not a ranged character. They, they are apparently good at hurting me while I, uh, while I attempt to hurt them. Alright, did a little bit of damage. Oh man, oh no, oh no, okay. Um, let me just use my little healy thing just in case. Uh, cause I noticed that I was getting kinda low on health there. So, that was not good. What is this? This is a big old mausoleum. Here lies Raymond Gundrick, First Lord Gundrick, conducted into the Legion and granted noble title in the year 839. Alright, what kind of loot does he have? Uh, some good stuff, apparently. And there's more over here, alright. So, um, maybe whenever we get to that next save point, I'll check my loot out and see what all I got. I'm getting some money, so that's nice. Stupid bird things. They give me a lot of trouble, it seems, because it's hard for me to hit them. Anjali does not have trouble, but I do, so that is not cool. Uh, I guess there's nothing else over here. Uh, let's go into the next little area for loot, like down those stairs. There's probably going to be some more bat thingies around soon. They like to pop up all the time. Uh, I guess these are all broken, huh? Yeah, no loot down here. What about the other stairs? Looks like there's some loot. Yes, there is. All right. I'm getting a bunch of loot that is not for me or Anjali, apparently. Um, so that's okay. That's just more money in my pocket. All right, save point. Uh, let's check out the loot I got real quick. Um, what is this? Plus nine attack. I lose my doom, but I gain fire and poison. I lose stagger. Uh, I'm gonna use that because it's more attack, and I get fire and poison. Um, those are not as good. Let's see this one and this one. Um, lose stamina, gain armor, retribution, lose stamina and armor. Uh, no. Okay. So now let's check out Anjali. Uh, yeah, those are definitely better. Um, she loses 1 stamina and 8 armor, but she gains 12 attack, so that seems worth it to me. And that is all the new stuff. Alright, save. 
Ah, and I came to the conclusion that I can do this. Uh, I realized this right before I started recording. If I go to this items section, I can hit X and transmute stuff. Um, and it told me that I can transmute things, and it gives, but it does not give me as much as selling them to a merchant, so I probably won't be doing much transmuting. Uh, not unless I hit a point where my inventory is full, which I have not yet, so I'm not sure it can actually happen. Ravensville Graveyard. Alright, which way do I go? Um, okay, go that way. No, how about I go this way? Oh, hello. Almost didn't realize those guys were all right there. Oh, hello. We're getting we're getting stormed here by a bunch of oh god, a ton of skeletons around me. If this was Minecraft, I would be dead. Victory. Yes, victory is correct, Anjali. Victory. Uh, I thought I saw some loot over here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this dead guy has some loot. Yep. Musket of rage. That must be for uh, Katarina. Alright, let's continue. Oh, hey! Almost didn't notice that. And uh, I have the, the electronic guide, and I'm pretty sure the electronic guide shows me the location of all the loot. Um, but I have my, uh, my in-game Steam interface thing turned off, so I will not be using the guide. Um, and I only have the guide because it kind of came with the game, so I don't really use it. Um, I try to avoid using guides. Because I feel like uh, I feel like using a guide is kind of cheating. Um, if I can't do it on my own, then I'm not good enough to, uh, you know, I'm not, if I can't figure it out on my own, then then there's a reason that I can't figure it out. Um, usually, it's just because I I'm not smart enough, or or it's you know something simple that I'm just totally not realizing, um, which which seems to be happening a lot to uh, to Good. And if you guys don't know who I'm talking about, I mean Good Boulderfist, uh, that's his YouTube name. Uh, he is, he is, uh, honestly, he is the guy that inspired me to, uh, well, one of the guys who inspired me to, to start doing LPs. So, if you guys don't watch him, definitely go look him up. Um, I like his videos all the time, practically at least one or two every day. Um, so that should be an easy way for you to find him. Whoa, what happened? I just got a black screen. What in the dark oh. sister's name? Are you some ghost of the Legion? Here to avenge your comrades? Something like that. I'm no ghost, but I will have revenge for my brothers and sisters. Will you indeed? We shall see. Yes, we shall. Your confidence only proves that you are ignorant, witch. How can you hope to best us? When the dead themselves answer our call. Kill them! I will kill them. Oh man, this is gonna cause me a lot of damage, is it not? I think it is. Uh, hopefully these guys drop a lot of health thingies, because I'm gonna need them. Um, I'm also- oh god! No, I don't wanna die. I don't wanna die, I don't wanna die. <laughs> No, don't want to die. I'm totally going to die. I'm totally going to die. Okay, but maybe not. My health is pretty full now. Um, oh god, what the hell are those things? They're chasing me. It's not cool. Anjali is apparently just throwing fireballs at this boss lady. So that's cool. Uh, how do I get to the boss lady? How do I get to her? How do I get to her? Okay, here's the path. Go around the path. Get to the boss lady and murder her face off. Alright, come on, boss lady. It's time for you to get home. Come on, Anjali! Help me kill this boss lady. I don't want to kill the skeleton that's behind you, though. Alright. Oh, she dropped some blue stuff for me. So that's nice. Definitely appreciate that. Uh, now let's see if I missed any loot during that fight. Because I'm almost certain that I did. Um, apparently Anjali picked up all the money. So that's okay. Because I didn't miss much. Uh, close to a level up, which is nice. Uh, I have no idea what level I actually am. But I guess we'll find out whenever I get a level up. Uh, I'm going the right way. Because I see a blue thing in front of me. Um, there's a save point first though. So that's nice. Save. And... 
and uh, I guess we're going into Raven's Drill, huh? Yep. It looked like a town, so I just kind of assumed that's what it was. Wow, okay. There's a oh, there's a boss guy here. I didn't realize. Um. Okay, level up. That is that is good. Alright, let's get all the loots. Alrighty. Uh, didn't realize there was a boss guy there at first. Um, so yeah. Alright, what is this? One-handed stance. The leaps into battle, charges into battle, delivering a strike. Uh, shrugs off blows by force of will, increasing armor. Uh, that would probably be the good one to get, but I'm gonna get this one. Um, confirm. And which one was I working on? I think I was working on Blade Dash, but let's make sure. Yep, working on Blade Dash here. Blade Dash deals an additional 20 cent per da 20 20 percent damage per rank and hemorrhage to bleeding targets. Oh, but I'm not. I don't. What am I doing that for? I don't. I don't make anybody bleed. Ew. That might not have been a good way to spend my three points there. I'm going to instantly target vital areas, gaining 10% chance to critically hit. I'm going to get this one from now on, um, just because I don't think I actually make anybody bleed. And then I guess I was working on this one. What about Anjali? Uh, Hurl spear. Hurls her spear through the air, damaging all targets in a line in front of her. Anjali sets her weapon ablaze, increasing her damage by 50% of her will and her attack DPS. To her attack DPS. By at okay, I can't read tonight. I'm trying too fast. Uh, empowered, ignites, set, ooh, alright, let's get that one. Uh, which one was I working on for her? I guess spinning kick, um, 20% chance per rank to inflict burning damage, but what is this one? Uh, uh, creatures have a 20% chance per rank to be set afire, uh, Anjali damages enemies with weapon when it is ignited, 5% chance per, um, let's go with this one. Just to where she might set people on fire. And I guess... Um, yeah, I'll go with this one. To where she has a really good chance of regenerating her health. When she takes damage, or does damage, whichever one it was. Um, honestly, I didn't really read it too well. I just know that's where I was putting points. So I'm going to continue putting points there. Uh, okay, enemies. <laughs> Um, and I was reading about one of the, uh, DLC for this, um, I don't remember the name of it, but it's something about a desert, uh, and I was reading the DLC, and apparently in that DLC you can, uh, you can respec, so having that DLC would be very nice, um, but at this moment I cannot actually, I don't have any spare dollars at all, so I cannot actually get it right now, um, so. is close. I can feel her eyes upon us. Really? Oh, there's a boss here. Which one is he? Oh, he's probably the guy with the metal helmet. No, apparently he's not the guy with the metal helmet. Um, he's the guy with the bow that has magical arrows that chase people. And he is very easy to kill, apparently. Um, what's going on here? Oh, more people. Okay. Oh, another boss guy. I think they're always in the center of the little circle-y thing. Yep, because I'm definitely in the center of the little circle-y thing, and I'm fighting the boss guy. Um, there's a bunch of loot. I know I missed some, but I guess, I guess not, actually. I thought I had missed some. Uh, I should check for loot around here. For all I know, there could be loot boxes just hidden away, like back here, but there is not, so I guess not, huh? I keep getting stuck on these barrels. Um, save, and then I got a blue thing in there. So let's go into here, to the blue thing. The girl. I know her. You do? Is this some kind of ruse? I don't think so. Me? You're mistaken. We've never met. Whatever illusions you've spun, you won't break my resolve. Really? Not even with such a cruel trick. Well, why is it a cruel my trick? My lady charged me to stop you, and I will not fail. Who is your lady? Oh, hello. Time to fight. Whoa! Oh man, I want her stat. That thing is 
cool looking. <laughs> Granted, it's probably for um, probably for Anjali and not for me. Oh man, I need to heal real bad. This lady does a lot of damage. Maybe I should just let Anjali fight her. Anjali seems to be doing a pretty good job on her own. Mighty slow. It might be a little slow, but she's doing a pretty good job. Um, maybe I should switch stances. Uh, here we go, here we go. Oh wow, that didn't really work, did it? Um, alright, come on. Come on, do your damage. Oh, get up, get up, get up. Oh wow, she does a lot of freaking damage. I don't think I can stun her at all. I've tried three or four times now and it has not worked. Uh, she's chasing me, which is not cool. Yes. What do you mean? We have defeat. Oh god, she freaking respawned. What the hell? That is not fair. Not fair in the least. Uh, am I stuck? No, I'm not stuck. Oh god, is she? Oh no, that's Anjali. Okay. I thought Rajani was made of fire for a second there. Oh, she has a second form, just like Anjali. Okay, maybe that's why she thinks she knows her, because they're they're similar. Um, Rajani seems to be in control of like some kind of psychic energy, though, and not not fire. Anjali is the fire version of Rajani, I guess. Um, where did you go? Oh, there you are. Okay, apparently that charge into combat thing is not very far. So, oh come on, cheating, 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 just running away and cheating. Why is she so afraid of us? Is it because we already killed her one time and then she like exploded into a new form? And it probably has something to do with it, but still. Oh come on, it's not. You it, are it, is it time based or is it like based on how much damage we do to her? Why is she teleporting every like 10 seconds? Oh come on. Yeah, what up? Something about we might have lived? We should look for Odo's friend, Lazar. Alright, which way do we go? We go that way, so let's go this way. <laughs> I know, it says go that way, so I say go this way. I know, I know. The Kingdom of Ebb is home to a wide variety of monster spiders. For this, most scholars blame the evil Sek who tried to seize control of this land before the founding of our kingdom. During the Imperial Era, the Sek were well known for breeding giant and intelligent arachnids. The so-called Arachnid Spiders gener generated silk that was prized across the Empire, and their eggs were priceless delicacies among the aristocracy. Male spiders were often trained and sold as guard animals, fetching 100 gold coins or more for a single arachnid. I got 15,000 gold, let me buy some. When the set came to ebb, they brought their spiders with them, housing countless thousands in the ancient ruins of Western Cross. The Sek were defeated by the Legion, but some of their Arachan spiders inevitably escaped, and their descendants are still with us. They have interbred with native spiders, creating larger and more intelligent hybrids, while retaining the advantages of both species. Females that are allowed to survive and flourish can grow to monstrous size, especially in remote regions like Rukenval. That must be the giant spider we fought in the beginning, um, one of the first few episodes there that giant spider that was uh, holding that guy captive and trying to eat him that must have been uh, must have been one of those all right let's go back to two-handed because uh, I don't know I like two-handed more granted uh, that one-handed kind of came in handy trying to defeat Rajani just now so can't complain can't complain Man, white loot? Really? I just killed a boss and now I'm getting simple white loot? That is pitiful. Another white loot? Man, come on. Give me better stuff here. Whatever. Just gonna flip them all. See what's behind them. At least they do exactly what I figured they would. Uniquely among human cultures, Versk tradition insists that humanity can trace descent descent from the beasts of old. In those days, say the tales, there were no bears, no wolves, no lions, only a vast family of beasts who could change their forms at will. 
According to these legends, the creator gods decided to appoint seneschals amongst the beast to enforce their will. These were the first Dakenware. But the gods soon realized that although the Dakenware would listen to their commands, they did not carry them out, allowing the beasts to do whatever they liked. So the gods revoked their favor from the Dakenware and created human beings to impose order upon the world, and men dutifully separated the beasts into breeds that were separate and distinct, forbidding them from changing their shape and bringing order to the natural world. The Dakenwire were cast out at the command of God, of the gods, and they retreated into remotest wilderness where they gazed upon men with hate. Alright, alright. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I have fought some of them. Um, I could be Thank wrong, you. though. Oh. I heard the commotion upstairs. Okay. That woman! She's not dead! Who are you? Are you the boyar? You're Lazar Vasili, the boyar of the town? Boyar is an old and stuffy title. Lazar is fine, especially among friends. Anybody else? You're the only prisoner? Rajani didn't lock anyone else down here? With Lascanzi walking the streets? No need. My people fear the witchmen. They're the villains of every bedtime story. And most of those stories are true. Hmm. All right. Yes, Rajani is alive. is beaten, but she isn't dead. Well, we shall soon remedy that. Yeah. How dare she march an army into Raven's Rill and murder good sons of the Legion? I'll see her hang. I like it. We should get back upstairs. Quite right. Before Rajani wakes. You know, not that she's not made of like magical energy or something and could totally kill you at any time, Lizar Basili. But, uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure Odo wanted me to keep her alive, but I think I might kill her. I don't know. I haven't really decided. You know what? I'm gonna save again, and then maybe, uh, maybe uh, I'll kill her, and if it doesn't go the way I like, then I'll reload and decide not to kill her. The I town don't know. is ours. They're fleeing into the woods in total disarray. What about Rajani? You saw how she fights. She calls fire at will, and her that eyes not fire. are like mine. Who are you, girl? You look like someone I knew. You speak with her voice. But that woman is dead and gone. Anjali is a legion? Anjali is one of us. A child of the Legion. Like me. My friend speaks the truth, Rajani. Whoever you think I am, you're wrong. Ooh, influence gain. Or perhaps you're a false prophet meant to lead me astray. If you fight for the Legion, you're an enemy. Nothing more. Why fight against us? You're awesome and powerful. You could totally be on my team. The Legion's done nothing to you. My lady has told me of the Legion's crimes. She defeated you once. What? And she'll defeat you again. Oh, it's Jane Cassinder. Jane Cassinder, The old enemy. Thirty years on and she's still hunting the Legion. And why should she not? You're traitors. Kingslayers. Murderers. Murderers? What? Kingslayers? Murderers? What does she mean? Lies. Stories that the old king was murdered by the Legion. That's how Jane Cassinda turned the people against us. She claimed that the Legion <laughs> betrayed its oath, tried to seize power for itself. There's a bar floating behind that guy. They're not lies. My lady spoke the truth. But believe what you want. What do we do with her? Wait, who are you? How can we be a threat to you? We don't even know who you are. She's an Archon. I know it sounds mad, but look at her. Just like the stories, only she's real. What do these stories say about Archons? They were divine messengers, heralds of the old creator gods. You see their pictures in books. Statues of them are supposed to bring luck. Hmm. Well, I have one with me. And her name is Anjali. Uh, I really want to kill her, but I should ask what we do with her. We have to decide what to do with her. Suggestions? She attacked a defenseless town, murdered your friends at the estate. Why are we discussing this? Kill her and let justice be done. All right. Wait. It's done. Listen to her Aww. words. She's misguided, confused. She fears us. Killing her wouldn't be justice. Yes, it would. She's well, yielded. I don't know. What if we set her free? Show Jane Cassinda that the Legion still has honor. Still has honor? What if I imprison her? Huh. Set her free, let her carry a warning, imprison her, or she has to die. Um. A warning. Warning to who? 
Um, hmm. I'm gonna go with this one. Okay, I'm gonna let her carry a warning. Tell Jane that the Legion remembers what she did. She will answer for every life she took. Yeah. You're mad to let me go. But I'll bring your words to my lady. Exactly as you spoke them. Alrighty. I agree with the armored wench. You are mad, both of you. Stark and raving. Shut up. No. We planted a seed. Now we wait and see how it grows. Come. We should return to the chapter house and decide our next move. Unless you still have business here. I do. I want to pick up that thing that's floating behind you. Wait. I want to look around first. Take whatever time you need. I'll wait by the door. Good deal. Influence gained, Anjali. Deed gained, Celestial Ally. Why do I still have Lazar Basili with me? Deed gained, Gracious and Victory. Objective completed, talk to Rajani. Alrighty. XP, 1990. Uh, alright, anything else? Quest completed, the battle for Raven's Rail, well, obviously. Uh, I guess that's it, huh? Alright, let's check out the loot I got. Uh, these are new. A lot of armor. I'm gonna go with those. These are not as good. That thing is not as good. These are probably not as good. No. Uh, not as good, and definitely not as good. All right, what about Anjali? Deadly Staff. Yeah, that thing's definitely better. Um, all right. Uh, yeah, that thing's better. All right, so I think really quickly, I want to know what was different about, uh, if we killed Rajani or not. So, I'm gonna go ahead and create a new save. And let's see, um, 2.20 a.m. Yeah, that's what time it is. Uh, that is, that is Rajani being alive. So, now, let's load game and do this one. And then go and kill her instead. Um, I want to know, I'm sure some people probably won't like me doing this, but the that's town just is too ours. bad. Alright, we already know. Who are you, girl? We already like know. Some... Anjali is a legionnaire. My Influence game. You're a false prophet. Meant to... Who you sent are... you? Jay. And why we should she not? Rajani you're dies now. I've heard enough. You'll answer for the people you've killed, Rajani. Blood for blood. My sisters will avenge me, legionnaire. You'll burn before you die, and your legion will fall. Silence, Rajani. You have spoken enough. Yeah. Justice indeed, for your friends and for mine. But now we'll never know who she was. Look, Rajani's spear. Ooh. This could prove useful in the right hands. Come. We should return to the ch not Wait. yet. Take whatever. T I want to look at her spear. Oh wow! All right, everybody, she's totally staying dead. She is staying dead. Yeah, definitely staying dead. Holy crap! Wow! Oh my god, that thing is fucking amazing. Sixty-five chaos lightning. Holy. Crap. All right, whatever. She's staying dead. Time to go. Let me go grab this thing. Um, I probably didn't gain as many deeds. I don't know. Let's go check. Um, I got full time. Uh, I gained this one. Earned the trust of the Archon Anjali. Um, and I got this one. Defeated the wrath of Jane Cassandra and slew her Archon handmaid Rajani. All right. And I got that orange weapon. All right, she's totally to staying leave? dead. I'm ready. Let's head back to the chapter house. Yeah, Rajani, sorry, but it was time for you to go. Against um, the might of the Tenth Legion, even the Archon Rajani could not stand. Jane Cassinder's lieutenant was vanquished. Her mercenaries hold on the Rukenval broken. The Legion was known for its mercy, 
in the past, but no more. For her crimes, Rajani was branded enemy of the Legion, and her life was ended by your hand. Yeah, it was. In the aftermath, the people of Ravensrill did as they always have. They rebuilt. Grief was set aside, for much work remained to be done. Much yet remained for the Legion to do as well. Rukanval was free, but our old enemy still plotted our demise. The Rukanval chapter house would not be our sanctuary, but a staging ground for what was to come. All right. Martin tells me that Jane Cassinder was behind this. She acted fast. That means she's afraid. At least Rajani is dead. She won't be reporting our strength to Jane. We need more Legionnaires. Our numbers are too few. Can we find more men and women of Legion blood? Might be a few left. Not enough to build an army. But if we spread the word that the Legion has returned, we can rally Jane's enemies against her. All right. We should start by reclaiming the Grand Chapter House, the old Legion headquarters in Stonebridge. Okay, where is Stonebridge? And well, no, what is the Grand Chapter House? So the Stonebridge Chapter House is different than the others? It's bigger, grander. They built it during our Golden Age after the heroes destroyed the Sec. We claim that Chapter House, hang our banners out front, people will hear that the Legion's returned. All right, where's Stonebridge? Have you heard any news from Stonebridge? If I had to guess, more smokestacks, more spinning machines, more metal men clanking through the streets. What? Is the chapter house still there? Are you sure the chapter house wasn't destroyed? By the people of Stonebridge? No, they never would. It's their mark of shame. Reminds them how they betrayed the Legion, what? and they don't dare forget. Damn. All right, I'm ready to go then. How do we get to Stonebridge then? Stonebridge lies to the south and west, on the far side of the swamp. Lazar's people have repaired the bridge, so the road should be open again. Martin and I will stay here for now. Help the locals rebuild. We owe them. They've endured a great deal for our sake. Can I go by Causeway? We have a Causeway gate here. Surely there must be another in Stonebridge. There is, but it's shut. Mon Baron ordered most of them closed to stop Jane Cassinder from using them against us. Ah. Uh. A causeway gate can only be opened from the outside, and only by a privileged few. Is Anjali coming with Why me? Why send me? We could all go together. The Radiant Youth chose you for a reason. You're meant to lead us, not Martin, not me. Oh, that's because I'm awesome. All right. I'll head south for Stonebridge. Jane Cassinda controls most of the land between here and Stonebridge. Her soldiers wear the raiment of the Azunite Church. Avoid them if you can. Once you're inside the chapter house, look for the causeway gate. Open it, and you can bring the rest of us through. You're the vanguard of the Legion. All our hopes go with you. See, up until that last sentence where he was like, you're the vanguard of the Legion, all our hopes go with you, it sounded like it was going to be pretty easy to get to Stonebridge. But then he said that, and it, uh, you know, didn't sound as easy. All right, so let's delete this one and just keep going on our singular save. All righty. So, how much time has passed? Uh, it's been almost exactly half an hour, everybody, so I'm going to go ahead and call this the end of the episode. Plus, it's roughly 2.30 in the morning for me, and I have to work tomorrow. So, I might call this the end of the episode, might actually record for another couple minutes, um, but if I do, that'll be another episode. So, until then, see ya!